As global demand for sil uh, silicon grows, chip fabs are opening up across the world. And leading the industry is Taiwan's TSMC, which recently launched a new training complex for the factory engineers of tomorrow. FTV got a special peek inside the complex in Taichung Central Taiwan Science Park. Students search for objects while wearing VR glasses. Silicon giant TSMC offered us a special glimpse of six training centers inside its Fab 15B plant. This is the first semiconductor factory development institute. New factory engineers go through a month of training, cutting their overall onboarding period from six to four months. You can save some costs and you won't ruin the equipment. It's quite realistic. You can get a feel for it, which means we won't be as unfamiliar with things when we adapt to the future environment. The students are excited to be here. Getting into the fab requires everyone to give up their phones to ensure confidentiality. More than 500 semiconductor factory experts have already been trained at the institute, including 15 from the company's U.S. 5 nanometer fab, as well as engineers from Shinju and Southern Taiwan Science Parks and future talent for Central Taiwan Science Park. TSMC has plans to spend 800 billion NT on a new 2 nanometer fab in Taichung with 10,000 employees. Every factory engineer holds enormous responsibility. We've been continuously building fabs over the last few years and have hired large numbers of engineers. I think for the Factory Development Institute, working out how to onboard engineers and get them into production fast is a very important task. Faced with a chemical supply system, engineers need to expertly navigate electronics, mechanics, water processing and safety processes and avoid any slips. This training center is a vital hub for the expansion of Taiwan silicon manufacturing worldwide.